The Congo Free State was a private colony established by the Belgian King Leopold II in 1885, in the territory of present-day Democratic Republic of Congo. King Leopold II exploited the country's resources, particularly ivory and rubber, through forced labor and brutal methods, causing widespread human rights abuses. Leopold II acquired the Congo territory during the European Scramble for Africa, a period of intense competition between European powers to claim territory in Africa. He claimed that his primary motive was to spread Christianity and abolish the slave trade, but his real goal was to extract as much wealth as possible from the Congo. To achieve this goal, Leopold II used a private army, the Force Public, to enforce his authority and to coerce the population into providing labor for the rubber and ivory trade. The Force Public used brutal methods, including mutilation and killing, to enforce their control over the population. The exploitation of the Congo under Leopold II's rule caused widespread international outrage, leading to the establishment of the Congo Reform Association in 1904, which campaigned for reform in the Congo. In response, the Belgian government took over the Congo Free State in 1908 and established a colonial government that abolished forced labor and improved conditions for the population. The Congo gained independence from Belgium in 1960, but the country has faced political instability, conflict, and economic challenges in the decades since. The legacy of the Congo Free State remains a contentious issue, and many Congolese people continue to suffer from the effects of colonization and exploitation.